Hello and welcome everyone to the next episode on Anubhav Learning Series with AnubhavTrainings.com. In this episode of Anubhav Learning Series, we will talk about how to explore the power of Business Application Studio. Business Application Studio provides us a exact similar experience like Visual Studio Code Editor and allows some of the amazing capabilities which we cannot access on Web IDE. So this video will specially help you to understand what additionally you can really do with Business Application Studio as compared to the Web ID tool. So our today's topic is creating scaffolding with Yeoman and SAP Business Application Studio. So let's try and understand what is Yeoman and how does Business Application Studio helps us to use these Yeoman templates available on the internet. So Meet Alex. Alex is my student. He has already taken training with me. Han is working as an independent consultant and developing variety of custom applications. So he's working in Fury development since a couple of years now. And he's developing web Fury applications using different tools like WebID or BAS now. So what are all the challenges and the questions Alex has? And I'm sure you'll be able to relate to Alex to also find out some of the questions which you also had in your mind. So the very first question each time, what, uh, whenever he would like to create a project, more or less the project structure remains always the same. So you can also imagine that if you would have worked in multiple projects by far, when you start a project, the structure of the project, which includes the controller folder, which includes the index HTML, the new app JSON, the manifest JSON, the, co the component JS or preload JS, all these files are more or less the same. You end up creating all of them again and again. Now, you would also want to set up your project when you're starting from, from it from a scratch. You would really don't want to spend too much of time in, in creating that project. So one option there which we have with Web ID is use SAP Deliver Templates. So SAP Deliver Templates like Master Detail, Fury Elements you can use and that creates automatically the structure and the skeleton of your application at the beginning. But what if my need is pretty different from the standard what, what Web ID offers? So each project should have different starting name and namespace. Of course with Web ID we can give that but maybe if if my if I'm developing so many projects and they follow a more or less the same structure, all of them still have certain things which are different. Now, also the Web ID does not provide me options to create custom templates, which works for my team. So in my team, we are following certain guidelines. We are following certain basic principles. We are also having reusable modules, reusable component JS, which we integrate and we always have those reusable components as part of our project. And every time when we start a new project in my team, I would end up copy pasting those, those reusable things again and again in every project. This would lead to high development effort at the beginning to set up a new project. I also need to generate prototypes with sample data many times. So how can I really be so quick to generate um, a, a basic simple theory app with sample demo data working on my system without really knowing too much about the Fury, also if I'm just a fresher. Also, how I can take best advantage of the SAP's new development tool called Business Application Studio? That's another question which comes in our mind. And finally, I took the training from Anubhav and I learned how to develop Fury applications. And during the training, we've also built a very simple fruit store application. And we, we wanted to see if I can uh, quickly get started no matter where where am i and if i don't have the zip file or the project resources with me can i also get um, the the simple basic fury application created during the training out of the box so all of these questions if any of these questions which are there in your mind or ever had it the answer is here and the answer is yeoman yeoman is a is a public repository of project scaffolding templates so you can also publish and develop your templates. And using these templates, you can set up your initial project really, really quick with just a couple of commands. And that's what I'm going to show. So I'm, I'm not going to show how to build a human template in this, in this uh, video, but I'll just show you a, a human template which I have generated on the, 
on the human website so i go to human.com so go to human.io and there you can go to section called discovering generators and for all those who have taken my training we we, we built the, the fruit store application with demo data you would see now i have created a human template out here just go there and search for anubau basic fury and there you go you can see i have a human generator which is now published 14 hours ago on the on the public repository of human and now all of you who are who have taken my training can can utilize this out of the box so if you are using business application studio then this is going to give you a great advantage so what i will now do is use this template which i published on human and i will show you how you can you can kind of go back and and generate this um, a basic application using this human template which i published on the internet So at this point, I will switch over to my business application studio and make sure we press Control Shift P first of all to switch over to the root directory of the of the bash. So just say workspace. Make sure you are on the root directory. So here you can see open workspace and make sure that you are on the topmost node called projects folder. So just select and say open. So I'm already there and you can see at this point of time, I don't have any project which is which is available on my bash. And what I now do is just go to terminals and say new terminal. And over here, I'm going to write a command to get that human template right away from the internet. So I can just search generator hyphen anubo hyphen basic fury. So just type command uh, npm install hyphen g, g means global. Please install a, a template. Uh, install a, a npm repository so it's called generator hyphen anubo hyphen basic fury generator hyphen anubo hyphen basic fury now similar to this one you can also have a requirement in your company and you can publish your own own templates on human human repository and you can see now it starts downloading this this human template for me in the in the business application studio in cloud platform and because in in most of the time i would need to get started with a very basic project and i would keep copy pasting every time my old project to new project and it takes a lot of time for me to set up a new project and here is where i can take really an advantage of this custom template and if i just go back and type yo command now along with standard sap ui5 templates you can see we have standard sap ui5 templates which is fury project adoption project Fury elements. You would have seen all these templates on the on the web ID. I have now Anubo Basic Fury template as well, which is which is created out of the box uh, using that uh, the generator. And I can press enter, and now it asks it starts asking me the necessary details uh, for this application to generate. So I can give my own name uh, to 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 give a name to my project. For right now, I'm not giving any name and just choosing what the template is offering me it asks me would you like to create a new directory for this project i say yes uh, what would be the namespace you would like to keep these are some basic stuff what you will also give when you create a project in web id using your own templates and the similarly i have also a prompt here uh, which i ask you all the details and then i will generate this for you guys out of the box just press enter and boom you can see now a project is created on my bash i can just close this command prompt now and let's look at this this project you can see all what you need to be able to run an application from scratch uh, or, or an application from my own template is generated out of the box you got the controller folder fragments iet and model style the custom styling the util fragments formatters the views component js the routing is done manifest is created you can see it has kept the namespace it has generated all the routes the basic master detail application it has generated every every single routing target um the root view the app.view.xml the everything it has generated out of the box and you can see this is the namespace and it has created this application what we exactly also learned during the training and i don't have to really do anything i can i can just right away go ahead and say test it now open with my preview and when i say preview 
you will see a very simple basic demo app with re with the data demo data is right away on your screen it's available i can just go back and you can just select anything you can go to supplier details you can see drop downs all the variety of things i can really do that over here it's a very simple basic application i can i have a search functionalities you can see the berries i can search things yeah i can cancel the changes i can save i mean all the th all the stuff which which we really learned during our training is is all right away right here uh, with us on this on this application so this is the basic application it's generated and now if in my company suppose i have a similar kind of requirement where i would like to generate the basic application out of the box i can definitely use this and this is where the new business application studio is is taking an, a, a new advantage out here and not that all in coming days i'll show you some amazing content where you can install visual studio code plugins and then you'll be able to do even the ABOP development with business application studio so there are a lot of amazing stuff which we can uh, we can do we can so this was just more of more or less an example of using yeoman using human template to generate an application out of the box so that was the main idea behind this so i hope you were able to get the answer of these some of the important questions which were there in your mind and it also helps you to understand why is this change why um, adapting ourselves towards the bass is an advantage because it bass will really give you this kind of amazing stuff so with that it's a wrap on today's session i hope you enjoyed it please give a thumbs up on this video if you enjoyed it you can also give a give a try yourself in the system to be able to create your first project using my human template you can just go back to human io and then also search for my template out there thank you so much once again for detailed training on ui5 and business application studio feel free to subscribe our our training on anubhavtrainings.com thank you so much and i'll see you goodbye